Meanwhile, in Lansing, Michigan Democrats unveiled a set of bills aimed at preventing another tragedy like we saw in Oxford. The package of bills would prohibit selling or possessing a magazine capable of holding more than 10 rounds of ammunition. If passed, the bill would take effect on January 1st of 2023. A person who possesses such a magazine before the effective date could keep the magazine if reported to local law enforcement. Law enforcement members of the armed forces and people working in an armored vehicle would be exempt. The bill Bill would also make a violation of the proposed law a misdemeanor. Second time offenders could face a felony charge. And the bills face an uncertain future in the Republican led legislature, which has resisted any new restrictions on firearms for years. Though the Detroit News reports that House Speaker Jason Wentworth expressed that he is open to reform suggestions. Democratic State Senator Rosemary Bayer, who represents Oxford, says now is the time to act. But when a tragedy strikes, we have a role to play. As a legislator, it is our role to propose policy changes that might be able to save lives and prevent this senseless tragedy from happening again. Make sure you stay with News 8 for the latest developments in the wake of the Oxford School tragedy. We'll bring you updates on air and online at woodtv.com.